Hi, Megan Mossbrucker with Usborne Books and More. I wanted to show consultants really quickly how to create wish lists for their customers. So the first thing you're going to do is go to your e-commerce website. So your consultant ID.myubam.com. And then if you're already signed in, you'll select my account at the top right. And then on the left hand side, you'll see your admin options. You'll select add wish list and then it only asks for two things so the wish list name and then the event for the wish list name i just like to put the name of the guest that i'm creating the wish list for so let's say that jane doe asked for a wish list so i'm going to say jane doe and then i'm going to select the event that i want the wish list to go under I've obviously created tons of wish lists in the past. The new ones will always be on the last page, so I just skip straight to the last page. If you need to edit the name or the event, you can edit it here. But in order to add books to the wish list, you want to select Edit Book Details. So I can always make sure I'm editing the right wish list up here where it says the name. There's a few ways to search for books. So you can search using these categories. You can search by age levels. You can search by genre. You can also use the search feature up here. Um, if you already know which books you want to add, you can search for them here. Uh, or let's say you know that Jane Doe's daughter is really into unicorns, so you can search for topics and themes here. In order to actually add books to the wish list, you'll just select the star. So if I wanted to put Fairy Unicorns, the complete collection, I could just add it here. Or I can open up the selection if I wanted to look at the specs or anything like that before I added it. I can click Add to Wish List here. Um, if you want to view your wish list, you can click here. It will also always have an ongoing subtotal for you. I always try to get um, about $300 worth of books on the wish list just to ensure I'm giving a good price range and a good variety and lots of different um, options. So this is what your wish list um, will look like. If you don't have this link at the bottom, then you might have to click update wish lists and then the link will show up here. If you right click the link, you can just copy that link address and then uh, send it via private messenger or post it on your event page, however you want to share that wish list link with the guests. Okay, I hope that was helpful.